we are looking at a, a scene in the opera that looks at, um, at 1935, the father, let's say, of what would become lobotomy. So we have a long history of working um, in unusual ways. An opera about neurosurgery and the history of that, involving spying and attempted murder and Nazi Germany, rivalry and ego and hubris. The topic is very interesting and very unique as well for an opera. So I think the theme itself was uh, quite accessible to us straight away, but it was a little different for us to work with actual opera music. The history certainly is extremely bizarre. I think these are stories that need to be told and, uh, and I think the librettists did a fantastic job at, at telling the stories. Clinical and scientific ethics is, is, is a live issue, basically. It, 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 it's complex and it's nuanced and too often it's kind of polarised and this, the story of psychosurgery is a case in point. My character is sort of responsible for this group of patients at the psychiatric facility and Monish, who's the sort of inventor of the procedure, has come to me and um, wants to use my patients for his experiments with the procedure. It's a pretty heavy uh, topic, um, but none, nonetheless it's important, I think, to get it out there. Yeah, the fulfilment that like artists like meet and collaborate and combine and that something like this happens. We work a lot with emotional states in Tanz Theatre and it was really great to sort of create movements that were uh, resonating with the actual project itself. But we've been blessed by this wonderful relationship with Morley that, uh, that Ken helped to develop. Really, it's uh, amazing that they've taken us seriously and have wanted to, to work with us. Morley being a unique environment where people studying as adults to develop their creativity in, in the case of dance, and singing and acting and as a college we're proud of being able to help people on that journey um, that when they produce something of the nature of this film we hope uh, it's something they can feel it's an achievement. Mm -hmm.